we are discussing the Gullian Berry syndrome. There are three types of Gullian Berry syndrome. Number first is acute inflammatory demyelinating polyneuropathy. Acute inflammatory. Acute inflammatory demyelinating demyelinating polyradiculopathy 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 this is the first type there is acute inflammation number second type is the exonal type of GBS exonal type of GBS so the number is exonal type exonal variant or exonal type the exonal variant or exonal type is two types acute motor exonal neuropathy number first is acute motor exonal motor exonal neuropathy and second type is acute motor sensory exonal neuropathy acute motor and also sensory exonal neuropathy exonal neuropathy the acute inflammatory demyelinating polyradiculopathy there is acute inflammation and demyelination of the multiple nerve roots occur due to the autoantibodies are formed against the multiple nerves but this is acute inflammation exonal variant are two types in which the exons of the neuron are damaged of a nerve exon of a nerve are damaged acute motor in which the motor exonal systems are damaged because of the autoantibodies are formed against the acute motor system in acute motor sensory in which the motor and sensory both systems are damaged of the nerves and neurons and as a result of the autoantibodies are formed what is miller fisher syndrome what is miller fisher syndrome